So a lot of you are wondering how our Jade Protocol investment is doing now that it's in the dumps. A lot of people in the Discord are going, Grant, what's going on with Jade Protocol? How is it going? Is it going to make it? Is it a rug pull? I don't think it's a rug pull, but is it going to make it? And what's next for Jade Protocol? And hey, how is this doing compared to Wonderland Time? So the price of Jade right now is $365.75. I first started getting involved with Jade when it was around the 575 to 600 mark and higher about a few weeks ago. Now, most people would think if you got in between that 575 and 650 range and I had purchased and restaked all in that range, and but I've also been purchasing and rebasing as it's been going down. If you were in any other cryptocurrency, or any other project, a lot of you might be thinking, oh my God, this thing is falling apart. And it might be. Let's take a look at this real quick. Jade Protocol is up and around the 367 to 369 mark, but it hit as low just within the last few days, $244.77. That's an all-time low. And the volume, the trading volume is also hitting these massive lows. And so it is possible this thing is falling apart. But again, most of you wanna know, wait, I thought with the compounding, even if this went down to the amount of money backed per jade, I thought you'd still get ahead. Okay, let's look. You can see here the backing per jade is $134.58 and jade price right now is at $365.75. Now, as we learned from Wonderland time, even if the price goes down dramatically, down to $2 as Wonderland claimed, with this type of compounding, you'd still be ahead by often three and four times your original investment by being diamond hands holder for about 12 months. So this is the principle of a lot of these high APY ohms. So even right now, you can see the APY is approaching $7 billion. So the, the staking is still paying out 28%. And so my staking is still growing right here. So let's actually look at my price. I'm logged in right now. <laughs> This is the highest I have earned per day on Jade, and I, my original investment was only 500 bucks. Think about that for a second. My original investment was only $500. I'm actually pending another bond. It's still pending for me to claim additional bond today. So even with the price of Jade at nearly half of what I originally entered the market, I'm up about 25 plus percent on my original investment. So it's actually going pretty well and the staking is actually working in my favor as uh, has been the plan. And imagine if this continued for any length of time. Now that's the next question. Will this continue for any length of time? Well, for those who don't know, Jade Protocol, SmartCoin, and SmarterCoin are all part of the Fair Launch Foundation. And their goal is to actually fork a lot of the very popular projects, but create something that they call a Fair Launch that actually helps diamond hand holders and favors diamond hand holders. Some of you who might be familiar with SmartCoin realize that their tokenomics actually drove SmartCoin's price into the ground, but those people with SmartCoin were able to exchange that for SmarterCoin. So over on the Avalanche Network with SmarterCoin, right now they're doing a campaign that lasts about nine days. And if you notice, the Jade Protocol also has what's been called the Doomsday Countdown Timer. For all the Fair Launch Foundation projects, they've got these timers that are trying to create excitement and interest and generate diamond hand holders around the smarter coin. So right now the farming yield is going up by nearly 1% a minute. This is a marketing tactic and it's a tokenomic tactic to get people involved and excited. And yes, the longer you hold, the higher your returns in smarter coin are going to be. As you can see so far, just today alone, I'm able to claim 48,000 smarter tokens. Now, if you look at the price of smarter coin on coin market cap, you can see the price per token is going into the toilet. And this dialogue around how's Jade doing? Well, the price is down. Is the Jade price down for the same reasons the smarter coin is down? This inflationary tactic is intentional by the Fair Launch Foundation group. And they're trying to actually get people in position to swap their smarter coins and I think their Jade coins for the FLF token, which is coming up. Is it a meme token? We're not entirely sure. Which phase of the 10 phase launch is this for the Fair Launch Foundation? We're not entirely sure. I personally believe that Jade will continue to produce its returns. Is it critical to the Fair Launch Foundation infrastructure? I can't say for certain. If you're in the Discord for the Smarter Coin Discord, which is starting to include all of their 
projects, the Jade Protocol Project, the Smarter Coin, and soon the Fair Launch Foundation. If you're in their Discord, the founders are very open, very engaged. They admit, hey, we're a startup and we're trying different things to get people excited, to get people involved, and to create value for them. And ultimately, the hope is that they actually build up the value of the Fair Launch token, I believe. But there are 10 phases, and I think we're only on the fourth phase of 10 phases. And who knows what's even ahead? And I don't even think the entire Smarter Team or Fair Launch Team even knows what the entire phases are. Grant that shaky, 100%. I've said from day one, Jade Protocol and the Fair Launch Foundation is a high-risk project. And this does not make up a large portion of our portfolio. Yes, it's an exciting, interesting, dangerous, scary part of our portfolio, but not a large part of our portfolio. The largest part of our portfolio is still ahead 300% for the year, even in the down market. And we'll show you that in another video. So how is this doing compared to the Wonderland time system? So the biggest difference I see between Jade Protocol and ultimately the Fair Launch Foundation and Wonderland is that it looks like Daniel and the crew at Wonderland are truly committed to creating a solid project. If you notice, the time price has held fairly steady in the worst this market has ever seen. At the same time, the team around Wonderland has managed to get the Spell token, which is part of the same project in Dev Group. They've been able to get it launched on Coinbase and other platforms, and it's adding value. I think my Spell token in the last two days has doubled, if not tripled. I need to check this morning. But if you see, the runway is still growing. The time value locked is still strong. The APY is still strong, and the staking is still strong. Minting is kind of flat in general. Minting is kind of flat. I might get involved now because I really do think that Wonderland has kind of hit its floor. But the main difference I see between Jade Protocol and Wonderland is basically a comparison and contrast. Jade is exciting, interesting, and completely risky, but it's part of an integrated plan. And that integrated plan could speculatively produce great returns or the greatest rug pull of all time. Now, on the Wonderland side, they are still fighting for stability. It's very boring. It's very interesting, but it shows a high degree of stability. And Daniel made a very intelligent pull of going ahead and selling a ton of AVAX from the organization while the market was at its peak just before the market dipped and saved us about $20 million in the treasury. Fantastic move. Yes, they moved without the permission of the entire DAO, but they went ahead and saved our butts and showed that they can make trustworthy decisions for the Wonderland ecosystem. So in summary, Jade's exciting. I'm ahead. I'm still ahead by 25 plus percent. I could actually run those numbers for you later. I'm going to still keep my money in. I'm going to still compound. I'm going to still increase my stake in smarter tokens. I'm going to still increase my stake in smarter tokens and walk out this process with the Fair Launch Foundation out of sheer curiosity and makes up a very small portion of our investment portfolio. And I'm willing to walk out that experiment so that you don't have to. But in the meantime, I still believe in Wonderland Time as a solid project that's stable in its price right now for the most part it's paid out its minting it's paid out its staking and they followed through with all of their promises and then some so that's my comparison and contrast if you like videos like this like or subscribe join our free discord please consider becoming a patron get our buy alerts get our watch list help build up a portfolio of your own and learn together with other people who are trying to remember the mission igniting lies of explosive significance starting with your own have a great day